All right, y'all, we're gonna jump right into it. Ryan DeCenzo has a new FP part that just got released on Thrasher a couple hours ago. And I'm super excited to watch it. We're gonna watch it together and I'm gonna talk about it. Ryan DeCenzo is someone who I'm a huge fan of. I've been a fan of him forever. I actually got to meet him and his brother Scott at the 2011 Dew Tour in Portland, Oregon many, many years ago. I was a young lad, but met him. He was super cool. Him and his brother were both so nice. Also met Greg Lutzka that day as well and Tosh Townend and some other really cool guys. So beyond that, let's watch this part. It's five minutes, 22 seconds long. And you know, it's going to be a banger song and a half. I'm assuming so excited for this. Let's go. Ready? Three, two, one. You are advised to go to your nearest shelter area immediately. Find that shelter area is not designed to leave the city. Your state civil defense director has just issued the following instructions. Knocking over the can. I love that animation right there. The tray flip. That's so cool. Who else is doing Tail 270s on rails? Tray flip to lip on a gap. Switch hurricane, you kidding me? Ooh. The, wow. Trey Crook, yes. On an electric box. Little spot maintenance, love that. Oh. Yeah. This man. That nose slide kind of seemed out of place. It was like a little timid for what's going on here. Such a good nollie flip. You can't say that Desenzo has a lot of variation in his tricks, but the tricks he does, he has down to a science. His tray flips are epic. Backside flips you don't really see super often from him. He's more of a frontside flipper, but when he does them, they look great. Oh. Switch heel is perfect. Nolly heel, that's a signature of his. Unreal. Wow, that's a sketchy spot. Chain wallet flip, inward heel. Oh, the bone on that. Rewind. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that backflip catch. And then boom, bolts. Unreal. That trick's sick. My apologies for the song. The song is rather profane and kind of silly. I'm not actually a fan of this song. The beat is good and it fits his skating. That Nolly Emerge was sick, but not a song I would have chose. Switch burial heel. Justin Bieber looking dudes giving him some props. I don't know how he nolly healed down on a brick ledge. Oh. Blunt slide to a death bomb. Those benches look so cool. That switch flip is nuts. Switch heel, what you got? Switch. Oh. Switch 180 to regular crook? Switch lip, huge front 180. I think that front 180 needed another angle. Ooh, Nolly and over backside, that's awkward. Nolly blunt slide like nothing. Gap to blunt, I think that footage may have been leaked, but that's a big gap into that blunt slide. Another fat lip slide. Nolly heel board. Crazy. Kick flip crook on the tallest tubba ever. How can you not get hyped watching that guy? Unreal. So much control on that kick flip crook. Ugh. Oh, part two, we got a faster song. Honestly, I think a faster song is more fitting because he is not skating slow. 
Nolly crook. That trick seems so scary. If you miss that crook walking, all your weight's on your front foot. You're dying. Oh, switch front side flip. Switch three. Unreal. No idea who this dude is, but that laser flip was insane. Nolly three. The Reynolds special. Oh. That gap nose blunt was nuts. He was locked in the whole time. Check that out. He did not booger slide that at all. Wow. Precision. Oh. That Nolly tray could not have been better and he knows it. Oh, sketchy. Ooh. That is tall, that's like 15 feet high. You do not want to mess up on that. Okay, maybe like 10 feet high, but still. It's not over yet, there's still some time. What's going on? Bev up. Holland, where is he? I don't recognize the spot. Oh. Oh, are you kidding me? Holy crap, that's like the biggest and longest front 360 ever. That was insane. Wow. For that being a five minute part, honestly, it felt like two minutes. That was like so jam packed of epic. Holy cow. This dude does not disappoint. He's like 36 now and he's still hucking down huge stuff. He's still doing his super tech stuff. Unreal. You'd think someone like this as they age would get more into like ledge skating, etc., to just kind of take it easy. That's what a lot of us are doing at this age. I'm only 31 and I've already kind of graduated to more technical type skating that's less hard impact, but Ryan could not care less if he was 36, 46, 66. I feel like we're gonna see this guy just shredding the biggest, gnarliest stuff like he said at the beginning, tell his legs fall off. This man is insane. Go watch this part. Like, leave a comment, blow this part up, please. I'll have the original linked in the description. Wow, I wish I could go skate right now, but I have work in 45 minutes, so I will not be doing that. But I hope you guys can go skate right now. Use some of this stoke, go shred. God bless, have a wonderful day.